Before Windows 7, it could be a chore to get all my devices connected and working with my computer. Today, I have more devices than ever. A digital camera, a mobile phone, a music player, a printer, and I want all of them to work with my computer. Hi, I'm David Washington, a program manager on the Windows team, and today I'll show you how Windows 7 makes it easier than ever to get all your devices connected and working smoothly with the Devices and Printers folder and a new feature called Device Stage. Let's start by connecting my portable music player using a USB cable. There. Now Windows detects this player and automatically opens Device Stage. Device Stage is a feature in Windows 7 that works like a home page for devices and printers. Notice how Device Stage automatically opens and is customized for this particular device. I can see a photo of the music player, its brand name and model, and a list of tasks I can perform. I can check the player's status, such as battery level, and how much storage space it has available. Depending on the device, you can change the settings, get help, get software updates, and more, all from within Device Stage. I want to sync some songs from my computer to the player, so I'll double-click Setup Sync. A lot of printers work with Device Stage. I'll connect this one, which can print photos and also copy and scan. Check this out. I can see what's printing, adjust settings, scan something, and more, all from within Device Stage. For some printers, you can even order more ink and other printing supplies. Device Stage is a handy place to see certain devices individually. But what if I want to see everything in the same place? That's when I go to the Devices and Printers folder. Click the Start button, and then click Devices and Printers. Notice how many devices are listed here. The Devices and Printers folder shows all the external devices connected to your PC, not the hardware inside your computer. So don't expect to find sound cards, video cards, and other internal devices here. All of these devices are connected to my computer. Most of my devices are connected by USB cable, but I also have a few that are connected wirelessly, like this Bluetooth-enabled phone. To connect a wireless device to your computer without using a cable, just click the Add a Device button to get started. You can do a lot more with this folder than just see what devices are connected. Right-click on any icon to see what you can do with that device. When I right-click the icon for the printer we added, I can check the properties, set preferences, start a scan, and more, all from here. If I double-click the icon, it reopens Device Stage, where I can do even more. If you double-click a device in the Devices and Printers folder and Device Stage doesn't open, then it doesn't work with Device Stage. Now you'll see how easy it is to connect your devices to your computer and control them with Device Stage and the Devices and Printers folder. You'll see how Windows 7 goes a long way towards making your computer the hub for all of your devices.